So we're looking at the uh, OHSU Health Command Center. This NASA-style center at OHSU was just added a couple years ago. The capacity snapshot, which shows us the uh, available beds. To keep it simple, it uses artificial intelligence to make sure there are enough beds for incoming patients across four hospitals, OHSU, Dornbecker, Hillsborough Medical Center, and Adventist Health Portland. It's staffed 24-7. Think air traffic control, just for hospitals. This one shows all the patients that are waiting to be placed in beds. In 2016, OHSU turned away more than 500 people because of a lack of beds. We were declining way too many patients. But with this system in place streamlining who comes and goes. This last year we declined 400 fewer patients. The tech used here can also use real-time data from patients already getting treated in the hospital to predict up to a week out if beds will be available. It's this type of intuitive technology that's helping people get better care at OHSU. Steve Brown, who is a futurist, predicts there will be more of this type of AI tech in the coming years. Use AI to help them give a higher quality of care. Brown says in the future, fewer people will be going to the hospital because more people will be using things like telehealth, where they get health care through a phone or screen. To communicate and manage my health remotely, without having to go physically into a doctor's office. And that's the next step for doctors here at OHSU, who want to develop what they're calling a virtual hospital. Dr. Matthias Merkel at OHSU is one of the doctors who is helping plan the virtual hospital program. The virtual hospital is really a vehicle where we can bring the clinical expertise to the patient. So let's say you live in a rural area, are having a health issue, and your local doctor needs more input. You can get on a video chat with a specialist at OHSU who works with your doctor in real time to figure out the best treatment. You get the care you need and avoid a road trip to the big hospital. It is a component of what you would describe as Skype, but it's also combined with uh, machine learning, with predictive algorithm. What Dr. Merkel means by predictive algorithm is that in addition to the video link, artificial intelligence may help in any diagnosis because it can scan millions of medical patterns and offer doctors possible causes of why you aren't feeling well. It doesn't replace us, it just makes us better. This whole virtual hospital idea is still a handful of years away, but more and more technology plus artificial intelligence are already helping doctors here at OHSU and across the country be more proactive.